Welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I'm gonna do like just a small get ready with me because my sister is on her way over here and she's gonna kill me if I'm not done with my makeup before then. I'm breaking out hormones. <laughs> but um, I just wanted to do like a little get ready with me because I feel like, I don't know, I just feel like talking to you guys. Let's just talk about the last couple months, where I've been, all that, which you guys know where I've been. If you watch my last video, you know where I've been. But yeah, I just wanna thank you guys so much for all the support and like the messages, all that. I am getting through it, kind of, I guess. There's some days good and bad, but I don't know. Just like the whole experience was crazy. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Just nuts. I'm like ready to move on with my life and just like live positively because I don't want people like, oh, poor her and things like that. I just, I cannot stand when people, sorry, my dog's walking. I can't stand when people treat other people like that. Like that like, oh, poor them, or I feel so bad for them. Yes, but also it's like, I don't want people to feel bad for me. This is just me speaking. I wanna just get up and like, it sucks cause like when you see people that know that you've had a miscarriage, they just like give you that look and you're just like, oh, I don't know. If you, you won't know until you have it or like something that is sad that's happened to you and like you see, you see someone and they just like give you that look. You're just like, oh, ew, stop looking at me like that. Like don't feel bad for me. Get away, oh, I just wanna give you a hug. I'm just kind of the person that's like, okay, yep, it happened, it sucks, it's sad, yeah, whatever, give me a hug, but like, let's, let's just move forward. Like, I don't wanna, I don't know, I just don't, I don't wanna dwell on things. It's not my vibe. Um, I kinda wanna do like a smoky liner, black liner stuff. Look at this, I had a zit on my ear. <laughs> Um, I'm not really like particular where I'm putting my stuff. I just don't care anymore. Uh, I just do what I want to do. You know what I mean? We're going to try this Laura Mercier cake liner. Hopefully it doesn't transfer. I'm not going anywhere today besides Best Buy because my daughter broke my phone. So just trying new things, talking to you guys. I'm over it. I'm just going to use an eyeliner. I'm so over it. Yeah, I've been trying these makeup wipes. These are the Bliss ones, and they're super fragranted, kind of like the Neutrogena ones. And they um, they burn my eyes. I'm really sensitive with fragrance. So now, today, my eyes are probably going to be watering all day because I just cleaned up with them. Now that that's done, I'm going to just go in with some concealer. I got Botox. That's one thing I like to do for myself is really just kind of keep up with my... I don't know, Botox and filler. I'm going to fill it, to get filler next week. Um, I don't know, it just makes me feel good. So, and I'm over 30, so I like to do the maintenance. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know, it just makes me feel good. So why not? I feel like, cannot wait to get my hair done. It's been seven months since I've gotten my hair done. That's saying a lot for me. I've never gone seven months without getting my hair done. Moving forward with life. Even during this whole COVID thing, I'm trying to find things that I can do to make me happy and live happy and Chuck happy, my family. It's hard, but I'm just trying to be positive. I'm trying to stay positive because it's Oh, I think Katie's here. It's really hard to be negative. I mean, it's really easy to be negative. We're trying to have good vibes, and I'm gonna try to post more on here because, I don't know, this makes me feel good. I like talking to you guys. It's like, literally, I know that you guys don't like talk back instantly, but in the comments you do, which I need to reply to a bunch of comments in my last video. But, um, I don't know. I just, YouTube's a different place for me, and I love it. Like, I don't have to go scroll through, like, a timeline that's negative, like Instagram, which I cannot stand right now. I don't know. It's just, it's, an, it's a good place for me. It's a good word. I like YouTube. It feels good. I love drama stuff, but not, like, Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson. Like, I don't really pay attention. I just, I knew Shane was that kind of person because I watched him back in the day. 
And honestly, I just like I knew Shane was that kind of person. And I feel like everyone's like, oh, Shane's, I thought he was clean cut and this and that. And like, you guys did not obviously watch his videos back in like 2010, 2000. And you know what I mean? Oh, that Botox baby. Anyways, yeah. So that's my stance about Shane Dawson because I already knew what kind of person he was. Like I have a very sick sense of humor, but not to that extent. Yeah, I just knew what kind of person he was because I feel like a lot in his new stuff, a lot of people thought he was something different. And I'm like, come on, Shane. People have not been watching you for too long then. Or they're all like Gen Z who are like two when they watched him or like didn't watch him because they were like two. You know what I mean? They were too young for it. Here's me over here, old as hell. Actually, I think Shane's the same age as me. Yeah, Shane's the same age. Yeah, you wanna come join me? Penny! Um, I like this cup, I look nice. Okay, Katie, can we talk? I was just telling them about Shane Dawson, how we knew what kind of person he was from his videos back then. Yeah, nothing's the same. <laughs> yeah, but I feel like he tried to portray himself as like the fun-loving guy, like well, people do change. I agree, but the thing is his humor is sick. Like, you know what I mean? Like but some people just have sick fucking humor. That's well, we do, but not like with the kids shit. Cause that's gross. Oh, that's that's not normal. But I, I mean, he literally jo joked about it. Yeah. Like one but, or two times. No, but it, it was a sick joke. Like it was wrong. Yeah. I'm not I'm the sure kind of person, just, but... I'm not the kind of Karen, wow, I'm so ugly. I'm not the <laughs> kind of Karen that gets very offended. No, I don't ever really get no, offended. No, of course, but like, you're like, okay, that's not funny because it's about this or that. But um, also, he was younger when he said that. That's true. He thought it was. People need to take that in consideration that time. Like, he was like, I 20. mean, something like that. Of course, it's never funny at any time in history. the universe, in history. But when you're young, like, sometimes you just, you don't realize. You say weird shit. You don't realize what you're saying. Yeah. For sure. Because I, mean, I know I've said a lot. I would say weird shit. You know what I mean? But I know not weird shit like shit. that. I gotta take my teeth out. I thought you were gonna say take a shit. Probably gonna be a loud ending of this video because Penny's screaming. Wow, well, okay. <laughs> we need to outline these lips. Does she even have lips? And there we go. There is my makeup for today. I'm gonna go do my hair, but. Honestly, I'm not gonna show you guys. You guys can go to my Instagram to look how my hair is. I'm just gonna straighten it. I kind of have horse girl vibes with the hair right now, but I cannot wait to get it done. It's a little wet still from last night. I have not been um, blow drying it, so. <laughs> Anyways, there's my video. I hope you guys like this little chitty chatty video. Um, and then my sister interrupting, but that's okay. I will see you guys next time. If you guys do like these like little get ready with me, they're easy to film for me and I like talking to you guys. So if you guys have any questions, leave them down below. I'm just chilling. I love making these videos for you guys and I will see you probably very soon. Bye.